the track and field section final is being held on Saturday. It's the first Masters track and field meet since 2019. Yeah, it's so great to have it back. The best track and field athletes from around the section competing at Davis High School on Saturday are Mark Willis and Brian Mueller were there to capture the big finishes. Brian Mueller saying hello from Davis for some Saturday afternoon field event finals. We'll start in boys long jump where Sack High Sports inspirational athlete Isaiah Griffin shows he can not only jump high on the basketball court, but also far into the sand. The Burbank senior's best jump was 20 feet 9 inches, but it was Lodi's Maceo McDowell that brought the fire for the Flames. He takes the title with a leap of 23-10. In girls long jump, St. Francis senior Kenna DeLamos comes up clutch in her final jump sinking into the sand at 18 feet, seven and a half inches, putting her in first place. But in the final jump of the event, St. Mary's Cameron Fields does her one inch better. She wins with an 18, eight and a half inch jump. In boys shot put, the big man from Enox took the day. Abayomi Babaloa goes for 52 feet, nine and a half inches. Girls discus, Weston Ranch Jr. Galadriel Melian waited until her final throw to unleash her best one, 137-6. That will be good enough to win it by a foot. Let's see some girls pole vault, and we were treated to seeing one of the best in the state with Oak Ridge senior Allison Sejeda. She sets a meet record by clearing 13 feet 2 inches, a definite contender for a state title. And finally, in boys high jump, the last man standing is the home track senior Ray Oldham from Davis going for six feet, seven and a half inches. And on his final attempt, he clears it. Oldham wins the high jump. And speaking of getting vertical, let's send it to Mark Willis, who was the eye in the sky for track. Thanks, Brian. And that eye in the sky caught some impressive races here at Davis Senior High School. To the girls 4x100 meter relay, Edison in lane 4 came in as the favorite. Aaliyah Williams starting things out for them. Clean handoff by all runners. And it's a dead sprint to the third leg. 300 meters down and it's a close one between Ryan Scott of St. Mary's and Nakia Johnson of Edison. Kamora Hill-Brown is in the lead when she gets the baton. But St. Mary's anchor Corey Fields makes up some time. Down the stretch they come. And Fields blows the field away. Finishing in a time of 46.66 seconds. Edison comes in second and Whitney comes in third to the boys 4x100. It's Oak Ridge, Argonaut, Jesuit, Rio Americano, Monterey Trails, Downey, Consumers Oaks, and Yuba City all qualified for the finals. Downey and Consumers Oaks came in as the favorite, but Yuba City just edges out Consumers Oaks. Joaquin Bocayo, Michael Rojo, Dorsey Sanders, and Amiris Baysmore finished with a time of 42.43. Downey in third. Now to the girls' 100-meter hurdles. Lane three is Corey Fields. Lane four is Yvette Harris of Lincoln and Stockton in Rockland's Gazelle Kirshner in lane five. Fields pulls ahead early, but Kirshner puts it into another gear and ends up winning in a time of 14.03 seconds. In the boys' 110-meter hurdles, Breland Reed of Edison, our scholar athlete of the winter season, is in lane four. Stephen Dahu of Pleasant Grove in lane five, but it's Wood Creek's Isaiah Earls taking the title in lane three at a time of 14.55 seconds. Cameron Williams of Merle West comes in second. Now to the girls' 100 meters. Keep your eye on lane four. It's Cameron Fields of St. Mary's, and she wins in a time of 11.81 seconds. Charlie McClure of Edison comes in second and Kennedy's of Sacramento Marlene Cavett finishes in third. In the boys 100 meter dash, six finalists in this one, Amarion Ashley of Edison in lane four, but the winner comes from Manteca Highs. Zion Allen wins in a time of 10.65 seconds, Ashley in second, and Michael Rojo of Yuba City in third. Finally, the boys 200 meters. It's McGregor to sell of Rockland in lane three, Zion Allen in lane four, he's from Antica, and Kanye Clark, the football standout at Capital Christian in lane five. And down the home stretch they come. Check out Clark, he's in the lead, but Zion Allen wins this one in 21.82 seconds. Clark from Cap Christian in second, and Rockland to sell finishes in third.